Hey, welcome back everybody. Today we're gonna to be talking about mirror selfies, how to take better ones, and how to get way more creative than the ones you see on Instagram on the daily. Stay tuned. Before we start taking any mirror selfies, let's talk about storage. I don't want any of us running into that pesky notification that says storage is almost full on your iPhone. So let's use Gemini Photos to solve that. Gemini Photos is an app that uses AI software to detect unwanted photos in your photo library like duplicates, blurry photos, or unwanted screenshots, separates them all out into different categories so that you can go in, select what you want to delete, what you want to keep, and Gemini Photos does all that work for you so that you can keep that pesky notification at bay. Check the download link in the description below to download Gemini Photos app today. The first tip that I'm gonna show you guys is actually one of the simplest ones and it's to make sure that your mirror actually looks clean. It could be a little mirror like this, it could be the mirror in your bathroom that's on the wall. Just make sure that the glass is clean so you don't have any gunk on it when you use flash or when you don't use flash. Make sure that there's nothing embarrassing in the background or the foreground. Just make sure that the photo is clean to begin with. The second tip that I have for your mirror selfie is to actually look into the lens, not like this, but looking into it in your reflection. Because most mirror selfies that we see, most people are looking down at themselves through the screen and it doesn't look that great for the entire image as a whole. So when you're holding your phone just like this, actually look into the camera lens through your reflection to create a more dynamic photo because the attention will be taken off of your phone and more onto you and your figure, whatever you're showing off in your reflection. So make sure that you look into the lens in your reflection. Tip number three is try to place yourself in an area with as much natural light as possible. Now I'm using a gigantic softbox right here, so just imagine that this is natural light. This looks way better than some people who take mirror selfies in dark bathrooms in like really yellow tungsten light. Try to find natural light so that your skin looks natural, your clothing doesn't look polluted by any synthetic lighting. And last but not least, don't be afraid to experiment with your mirror selfies and get creative. We've seen the typical show off the fit type mirror selfie. We've seen it a million times. So don't be afraid to experiment outside of that. I'm gonna show some different examples that you could draw inspiration from right here on the screen for you. Like this is all like random thoughts that can come into my head and there's so many random thoughts that could come into your head as well. Don't be afraid to get a little bit creative with it. 